I'm Allison Lever and I graduated in 2007. I work at Children's of Alabama. I'm a child life specialist in the emergency department. Um, I think HDFS gave me a really strong background in child development, which is still something that I use every day in my job, um, applying it to the clinical setting and meeting a child being able to figure out where they are developmentally so that I can then apply it to prepare them for whatever procedures ahead for them. Um, I did a lot of work at the Early Center, like most people in my major, um, but also I, um, I would say what impacted me most was my time spent at the hospital. I was at EAMC um, for several hours and um, I feel like it was important for me to know that I could handle a hospital setting. Um, I don't know that everyone can. There's some people that don't enjoy what it feels like to be in a hospital. <laughs> um, and so I think it's good for you to learn that about yourself when you are um, becoming, or when you think you want to be a child specialist. That's something that you need to know about yourself before you start your job. And so that volunteer and practicum experience really um, helped me know that it's something that I would enjoy. I think child life is a very unique field. Um, a lot of people know about teaching and nursing, um, and I actually started out in nursing and considered teaching. Um, clearly, I wanted to work with kids, but um, I feel like teaching is teaching a group of kids, which I knew was not for me. Um, and so learning about child life and figuring out that I still would have the opportunities to teach kids, but on a one-on-one -on -one level, um, and teaching them about their experiences. No, I don't teach about school, but I get to teach them about the experiences that they may encounter while they're in a hospital. Um, and through that can lower their anxiety about being here. And so there's just something very powerful about that um, and a very unique role in a very scary setting um, for kids. And um, to be able to help them through that and help the families as a whole navigate um, what could be a kind of scary journey um, can mean a lot to families. And um, so just kind of setting it apart from what majors a lot of people know about, which is teaching and nursing. Um, they're just kind of a bridge between those two. You still are involved in a hospital setting um, and you're teaching kids, but it is in a different, um, with a different perspective and um, on a different level that um, can be very meaningful to a child during that moment and in that moment of trauma, but then also long term and um, helping them take those positive coping skills that we've taught them throughout life.